welcome to Las Vegas, also known as Sin City. This place does not sleep. Now, amongst other things, we're actually here to play some golf. However, bit. we've decided we need some local expertise to help us out on the course. We're gonna grab some local caddies. Straight to the internet we went, researched a couple of websites, but much to our delight, we actually found entire sites devoted to female caddies. So, it was a bit of a no-brainer which way we went. Female caddies. I first started caddying when I was about 12. My dad loved golf, so I used to go out with him all the time. And then I just fell in love with it and I can't stay off the course. Looks like we got a par five here. You should probably use your driver. All right, give it a whirl. And then some of my friends, they found a website um, and told me about the caddy list. And I looked it up and decided to join that to get me to college. I love Vegas because people are fun and you definitely get to meet a wide, like just a total wide variety of people. Uh, I said a little higher this time. I think you took some grass out. Looks like uh, about a 237, so you could probably do a green. Okay. Are you trying to hit the ferrets? Some guys get out of line, they try to hit on you and stuff. They come out and they think it's like hit on you time and it's not. It's not an escort service, it's a caddy service. Once they hit on you, they kind of get delisted and so it takes care of that. Oh, superstar. That wasn't too bad. Maybe you should use that club for every shot you take. Any tips here, Charles? I aim for the person right to the left of the cart. <laughs> Just knock him out? Knock him out. Well, Kirk and I have been uh, going at the money game all day. And now we're standing on the 18th and the girls have suggested that neither one of us can make birdie. So I'm confident. Extremely confident. So we're, we're going we're gonna to go this challenge. And confident on the last hole as well? I've been confident all day, it just hasn't worked out. <laughs> yeah, well, we, we just haven't played good. So, bottom line is if we don't make birdie, we're going to have to caddy for these girls tomorrow because they like playing just as much as we do. And they may even get to pick the outfits, apparently. We're going to have some nice looking caddies tomorrow. <laughs> anyway, we're, we're making threes here, I guarantee it. Oh, got that one. You're in trouble, girls. Yeah, you've still got a few more to go. <laughs> Both of you. Ooh, that's not bad. I'll take that. You definitely get your um, your big spenders. Got my biggest tip ever there. I got $2,000 one day from this one guy. He was like sloshed and had been playing blackjack all day and he won and he was the big winner. But people are usually generally having a good time so they don't really care, you know? So I definitely make more tips out there. You should probably use a five iron here. Five iron? Well, 40 yards from the green. No, no, definitely five <laughs> iron. I do play. I'm not gonna lie, I'm pretty good. Probably kick your ass. We've got putts at it. I wouldn't get too dancey yet, boy. <laughs> <laughs> good luck on this one. So what are you seeing here, Meredith? Looks pretty straight on. I wish I had an air horn right about now. Oh. Amateur. Ah! Don't you both Look, <laughs> We wouldn't want losers. <laughs> okay, ladies, thank you both for a great round thank of you. golf today. We had a great time here in Vegas. Highly recommend getting yourself a caddy next time. The expertise and knowledge these girls have around the course is second to none. On the last hole, don't make any bets. <laughs> That's a big tip.